What's up you guys? Welcome back and welcome if you're new. In today's video, we're gonna be installing some rock sliders from my good friend Jerry. You guys probably better know him as Beast Fab. I'm gonna let him introduce himself. How's it going guys? Uh, this is Jerry and Beast Fab. We do a little bit of everything. We have a shop right here. So we do general fabrication, uh, we install lift, we lift trucks, uh, body armor, all that kind of stuff. You know, a little bit of everything. So if you guys need anything, uh, my contact info is gonna be right in the box below, so anytime. And make sure to stay tuned because the rock sliders that we are installing today, they have a little bit of custom work made to them, thanks to him. So make sure to stay tuned so you guys can see what we're talking about. So before we get into the installation process, I'm gonna have Jerry just show you guys and explain a little bit on the different styles that he has made. So let's go ahead and uh, show them. All right guys, so as you guys probably know, um, we have different styles right here. So starting with the low pros, you know, as you guys can see, it doesn't have the key cut at the end. So um, we have this style right here. They're not done yet, but I mean, you can see the layout in them. So this is pretty much more simple, you know, full straight seam line. Uh, more tucked into the cab so that's pretty much more like just protection and and pretty much you know a little bit of look so like like flush look and with the kick outs pretty much I mean they're a little bit more wider so actually you can use them as double purpose um, to step on them get in the truck and also with the kick out in the back so that's for more protection and obstacles so they can kick out the truck and get you out of there so we have two different ones that's uh, that's one of the newest ones right there a little bit more uh, square shape and the other one right there at the end that one's a little more rounded shape so on that one you know uh, you know either or they're pretty good at it so um, but yeah guys also you can go different options as uh, filler plates full length uh, if you want to do anything in the key cows like custom uh, any lettering or whatever I mean we can do all that too so we're gonna show you guys a little bit on Jesse's so you guys can have a better idea alright guys so what we're doing right now we're gonna clamp it onto the truck what I usually do uh, pretty much I just get under the truck my little card right there um, I just grab the slider I just put it on me and I just clamp it on it so um, everything right there has a and the play the chassis plate already has a pattern for all the holes and everything so um, this design is uh, it comes for bolt-on option um, we can do also well done but I mean on the Tacomas you know it's getting pretty much popular uh, the bolt-ons and easier to take them to install them and to take them off if you have to so um, pretty easy it takes takes around an hour to install them um, uh, we have to drill a few holes but everything else already there we just got to drill the, the bottom holes but everything else already there so yeah I'll show you guys the process right now All right, so before we show you the actual finished product, uh, we already have it installed. One thing I did want to note is you're going to notice there is bolts, washers, and stuff like that going all along the whole slider. Those bolts, washers, and everything like that is provided. And just in case you guys are wondering, the bolts are grade 8, so it's going to be one of the best bolts that you could get. So we're going to go ahead and start off from over here. So this bolt here, we did have to drill a hole, and then the bolt goes there. As I stated, it is provided, and you put the nut from the other side and same thing with this one and the one on that side now looking inside over here and you're going to notice the ones that are on the inside right here it's going to have a steel plate washer of course with the grade a bolt those as i stated do come provided there's one there there's one there and there's also one more inside of here you do have to remove there's like a plastic piece here you have to remove it but yeah there's another bolt there all of that uh, those are going to be 100 percent bolt on so just letting you guys know so we're going to go ahead and lower the truck now and show you guys how it looks on the opposite side all right so now i'm going to go ahead and show you on the opposite side just in case you guys were wondering so looking at it from this angle here you're going to see it goes all along this way i'm going to go ahead and start from the front so you're going to notice we are on the driver's side 
There is gonna be a bracket here um, from the factory and you're gonna notice there is a clip there, there's bolts there and stuff like that. So the way that uh, Beast Fab does have these made, it's gonna fit for a factory fit, I could say, um, because it does have all the cutouts provided. So that way you don't have to remove anything else. The only thing you do have to remove, but then you reinstall is this bolt to go ahead and install the actual slider. Once you have it, of course, installed, you can then reinstall this. And as I stated, it makes it for a factory look and everything is cut out. So it makes it really easy to install these. So I would highly recommend them just because of that. And of course, the actual quality build of them. All right, so now that we have them installed, I'm gonna go ahead and show you just what we were talking about. So of course, these are the ones with the kick out. So as you can tell, his logo is gonna be right there. And as we stated from the beginning, they do have some custom work done to them. So pay attention to this side. Let's go ahead and walk to the driver's side now. All right, so now that we're on the driver's side, you're gonna notice it looks exactly the same as the opposite side. But when you come right over here, you're gonna notice there is something different. I hope you guys like it. Check that out, damn. So there it is, you guys. So that's what we were talking about as far as custom work. All right, guys, uh, hope you guys enjoyed the, the process of installation. Um, if you guys need anything, any sliders, fabrication, uh, any other stuff, you know, my, my information is gonna be right in the, in the box description below. So I wanna thank Jesse for coming over again. So we're gonna be doing uh, big stuff together, so keep guy posted. Just in case you guys are curious, this installation does take about an hour. Um, he could do yeah. it for you guys, of course, it's gonna be a charge. Uh, if you guys do want it, it's there. So if you guys did enjoy today's video, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. We'll see you guys next time. Peace. Adios.